How you doing, guys? I was going to do my uh, show you the full cleanup on this. We had a yard that's in a HOA violation. Uh, left my tripod at home, so uh, yeah, it's wet. And all we're going to do here today, guys, is just cut the grass. And we eat it, and we eat the beds. Uh, that's all they want to do, so that's what we'll give them. Uh, I'm having to kind of be quiet. I'm about to wake the whole neighborhood up, but it is 7.30, so. It's not my fault they want to sleep all day. I left home at 6.30 to get to this job. It's the furthest reaches I run. There's the house. Nice little place. All right, guys, I'll update you when I'm done. All right, guys, welcome back here. Uh, showing you the backyard now. big yard and it just drops off at the woods and got a swamp behind it y'all can see i mowed and trimmed everything including the neighbor's fence on each side yeah, and the reason i'm doing that is so i'll turn it in since the neighbors still own a foot on this each side of the fence because you can't put it on the property line and I'm doing it. I'll turn it in and then within 60 days they'll send them a bill for keeping it cleaned up. They won't pay it. They'll go after the foot of land on each side and they'll have to move their fence in from the property line a foot in. And then I'll make a commission off of that. It's 100% legal since people don't know what they're doing. This is what you're looking at here, guys. Beautiful house. But yeah, there's the yard. Um, not much going on today. This was the HOA violation I done. Uh, you got to go to Mountain Brook. Probably a 40-minute drive. I got to go up there and quote a million-dollar home on keeping its uh, yard up. And I'll keep you updated when you have a good one. Hey, guys. You got Nick with Nick's Yard Care. It's the backyard. I gotta get this cleaned up here. I'll walk you around it whenever we're side yard ain't good either. Uh our uh, attendant is home that rents the place, but this is what we gotta take care of up here. <clears throat> yeah, it's only inclined guys. I wish I could do the whole video of me doing it, but that's not practical on this short. I'll pick you up when I'm done here. All right, guys, I'm back. Here we go. She's cut on a one time over. It's all they want to pay for, you know. I don't blame them. They don't own the house, they rent it, but they have to keep it up. Let's get up the hill here. No, I don't edge it, but I do put a hard trimmer edge on it. That is to give it the kind of look it needs. Well, there you go, guys. This one is down good for two more weeks. So I'll catch back up with you in the truck. Welcome back, YouTube. Another day. This one just got done. It was my lap property. It's one of my commercials I do. <coughs> Excuse me. I didn't have time to get it before. Only the after. I'm trying to hurry up and get done before they get out here this morning. It is a business. I'm trying to get done before the owners get here and customers start coming in. <coughs> Excuse me. I got something in my throat. This is what we got, guys. I just wanted to show it to you. Uh, keep tuned and I'll see a bunch more today. All right, you too. You've seen this house before. Here's the backyard. Uh, let's go up here to the front real quick and look at it. This is the before of it. Uh, shouldn't take. Not doing any more leaves on it anymore. So it shouldn't take 25 minutes on this yard. Uh, that's all we got, guys.
Let me get to it and I'll catch up with you when I'm done. All right, guys. Welcome to the after of her. Yeah. She turned out pretty good. Uh, the yard is nothing but honestly a bunch of weeds. Except for the front. I'm not even sure what it is. It might be centipede all I know. But you still can't take the... No matter what machine you use, if it's a good commercial machine, you can't get rid of the cut quality. And that's what the Xmark Turf Tracer, guys. What it'll do for you. All right, let's get to the next one. All right, guys, we're back. Uh, I meant to do some filming while I was on this yard. Uh, got in kind of a hurry. Uh, trying to get it done instead of doing any type of filming or anything. That was due to the fact of uh, I've got another stop to make on the other side of town that needs a cleanup today, and they're wanting it to be, uh, what do you call it, quoted today and done tomorrow or Friday. That's what we got, guys. I'll pick you up on the next one.